Hello friends, in today's video we will see how we can install uh, WordPress using virtual main. Okay, so let's get started. First of all, you need to log into your virtual main console. So I have my server hosted in Azure. So and this is uh, just first log into webmin, provide your credentials. Once you are logged in to your virtual main console, uh, create on. Let's create a new virtual server. You can name whatever you want or your website name. So here I will give as my home portal and provide the password. Okay, and go to enable features and make sure you, you have selected this create mysql database i'll remove this mail as of now and then click on create server now my virtual server is created Let's go to edit users or in fact let's go to database, edit database and you can create a new database or use the existing one. Click on manage. Create a new user. Uh, give the name as home portal SQL. Okay, I'll set the password. It is localhost. I will give all the permission here to this user, or you can restrict the permission as required. But just for test purpose, I will be selecting all because I won't use the database for any other purpose. So this is the user home. Now let's go to file manager. We are done with the database configuration and uh, Go to file manager and then click on file, upload to current directory and upload the uh, WordPress zip file which we have downloaded from the uh, WordPress website. So I have already downloaded it with WordPress 5.1. Uh, so I am uploading that. You can, if you have not uh, downloaded it yet, you can go to the WordPress site and download the file and the upload will depend on your internet speed so it's getting uploaded once the zip file is uploaded just click on here and click extract this will extract all the files to uh, a folder called wordpress see it has ex extracted all the files inside it just go inside WordPress folder and uh, click here, select all, go to edit, click on cut and uh, then go one folder back and then go to edit, click on paste. Actually what we are doing is we are copying all the uh, WordPress files to the uh, home directory of uh, this website, home portal. So now we can we'll see all the files here. Okay, so it's done. I uh, see all the cough. Then go back and select this file called wp config hyphen sample. Click on it. Click on rename. 
and rename just remove this word sample here and make sure it's wp-config.php click rename okay the rename is completed now go here and go to the same file again click on this and click on edit now here you have to provide the uh, database details which we have created some time back here so now the database name now the database was our home portal database user uh, we have created the username as home portal sql and now you can pro provide your uh, sql password you can enter whatever password you have set click on save and then close this now we are done with this uh, initial configuration let's go to our website and configure it home portal dot my home dot com so you give the site name as your site name uh, your site title username uh, you can give any username make sure uh, you remember the password here because this will be the username password used to log into wordpress console i'll give the password here provide your e email address and if you don't want your website to be uh, searched by the search engines and um, to disable the indexing you can check this option here and then click on install wordpress okay your site is ready now let's log in there you go so now you have all the options here is your website you can con do all your whatever you want in your website and write your blog post you can go to dashboard and add plugins so we are completed with uh, the wordpress installation and if you have any question or query you can write on the comment section of this video and do subscribe to my channel for to be uh, posted up uh, for the new upcoming videos thank you thanks for watching bye bye